for coming in. Yeah, absolutely. Mason Massey is a pro auto racer, a dirt racer, a stunt car driver, and I'm so jealous his his, his whole lifestyle, but um, he gets flown to location to drive the most exotic cars in the world for people who might be able to buy them. So I want to do one of like like a Tom, Tom Cruise mask, where I can like peel his peel his face onto mine, fly in and tear up those cars. But anyways, um, thank you for coming in. He's going to share a few words, and he's got a video that I, I'd like to show you. Is that good? Perfect. My name is Mason Massey, and, uh, and uh, like he said, I've driven race cars all my life, and I do some stunt driving as well. And uh, I've also had a, 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 a stutter all my life, too. Uh, I mean, probably ever since I was little, you know, uh, four to five years old, something like that. And, uh, uh, early on, it was really hard, you know. I mean, it's always hard to make friends when you can't really talk well because you uh, can't really communicate with anybody. Uh, and um, and all the uh, the uh, teasing when you're little is tough too. But uh, I had a hard time when I was little. I, you know, wonder why God gave me this, and I uh, I uh, I uh, question Him every night, and. Um, but as I got older and more uh, more uh, mature, I started to realize that that he gave me this for a, a reason, and it, you know it's part of who I am, and it probably always will be. And uh, when I got older, I started to be more uh, more okay with that, and um, you know because uh, my friends I have, my family I have, they all love me for who I am. And uh, they always will. And uh, I, uh, I went to Mr. Tim when I was about eight or nine years old, probably. And I went to him for a little while. Then, and then I kind of got uh, really busy with racing and kind of didn't uh, go to therapy much. And I was racing a lot. And you know, when you're racing, you got to do a lot of uh, talking with uh, with uh, interviews and. And telling your whole team, you know, what to do to your race car, you got to do a, 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 lots of talking, and so that was always hard for me to get, get uh, in my head, just because uh, it was always something I wanted to do for, for my living, and um, it was hard at first, but you know, the, the more interviews you do, the more talking you do, it gets easier and easier. And you finally just, you know, you say this is who I am, this is who I'm going to be, and um, you know, it 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 kind of you know it kind of helped me stand out to people. It kind of uh, you know you know brought some attention to me, which wasn't you know bad attention. It was just you know, uh, and you know, getting older, I I I I I uh, I uh, raced for Bill. Elliot, I don't know if y'all know who that is. Uh, I I for him for a little while, and um, we we uh, we uh, we uh, 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 won some races with him. And that's what kind of put me on the map, and um, and and uh, also driving the uh, the uh, the high dollar fancy cars. That's pretty fun. Uh, I kind of got in with that through someone I know, and the whole time you're doing that, you have to talk to these. People who are, who were who were wanting to buy these cars, and a lot of them are are are, are pretty pretty uh, in 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 intimidating and just straight to the point. Uh, so it gets hard sometimes, but that's made me better. It's made me more uh, more out outgoing and more uh, more accepting of, of 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 myself because I have a talent that that I can use, and you know. Uh, I can use that talent to get me to where my voice matters and just inspire people who ha have any issues in life. Because we, I mean, because we all have issues we have to get past in our lives, and uh, this is one of mine. And uh, I just always wanted to help people get past their issues because there's 
a, a, a lot more issues I could have than this. There's a lot worse issues. So I, I, uh, I'm uh, blessed uh, in my life for what I have and you know what I've been through. And I went back to Mr. Tim about uh, two years ago, and he uh, he uh, really helped me get going on the path of you know when you're a kid it's kind of different but when you're older you have to start you know talking to more people doing more things so he kind of got me on that path to be able to really uh, talk to anybody in any uh, type of a of a of a of a setting or anything so I, I'm, I uh, really appreciate what he did for me um, and he's helped me gain my confidence and stuff so uh, just real thankful for that and uh, this video he's about to show you all was made about uh, two years ago and um, it was me it, uh, in my natural habitat at the racetrack so uh, hope y'all enjoy. <laughs> Thank y'all. Mason Massey, and uh, I drive race cars. Uh, I have over 300 wins. You know, I used to count when I was younger, but I kind of started to lose count. My goal is uh, always been NASCAR. Always has been, always will be. Uh, that's really what I've worked for all my life. Uh, I don't care about the fame or the money, really. I, uh, I, I'm just a racer. That's, uh, uh, that's why God put me here to, to be a race car driver. NASCAR is millions of dollars to get into. Uh, I was not born into millions of dollars. For people like me who don't uh, have that kind of money, we do the best we can with what we have. And so uh, until a big time sponsor comes along, that's what we have. And um, yeah, I, and uh, I'm just trying to do the best with it I can. I can win every race I run in, and uh, and still never make it to NASCAR without the money. But racing is a uh, really cruel, and life can be really cruel too. But I've stuttered all my life, and um, I definitely have some people that make fun of me when I was younger. Uh, to mock me. Being mocked over and over will make you question, you know, why am I even here? What, what is my purpose? And, you know, I can't even talk, so why, why put me here? When I was younger, I always had a hard time uh, saying my name. I was really in a dark uh, place. It made me work harder to where everyone knew my name so I wouldn't have to say it. The thing is, I know that God gave it to me for a reason. And uh, that reason is to race. We all have our, uh, our challenge in, in life. We all do. And you have to make it a positive thing to uh, 
have a good influence on people and uh, show them that it's possible to overcome your challenges and to make it to where you want to be. When I make it to NASCAR, I believe that's the reason I did. I don't know what the future holds, but I really would like to think that uh, my future holds a lot of pages in it. And, um, and you know, I'm going to work hard and just, and just uh, make sure we write those pages.